Hello viewers, this is Michael from Screen Review, bringing you a new podcast for myself called the Super Sentai Review. And like always, I'm going to speak very loudly, very clearly, and very slowly, in case you are under understanding. And also, I try to do my best not to break your heart during this audio podcast recording as well, not to cause any audio feedback as well. And finally, if you're under 18, this audio podcast recording will change your adult language if you're under, uh, if you're under 18. Now, if you're over 18, that means you get to watch this audio podcast recording. So anyway, with this and anything else out the way, Let's get into the latest episode of Boom, of Boom Boomers. So basically, the episode starts off like this: We see the Rangers, we see we see the Rangers, except for Joe, uh, except for Joe, who is you know, opportunity, uh, Joe, which you know, is a coach of a uh, of a child baseball team. So basically, the other Rangers, except for except for Sino, Sino, the Boom Violet, you know, was talking about how how. How 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 proud that are they of Joe? You know, coaching a kids baseball team. So basically, you know, while the Rangers, while the other Rangers were talking about how how proud they are with Joe coaching a you know coaching a child's baseball team, you know, we see Joe, you know, you know, pra- you know, practicing with the kids and whatnot, unknown to them, you know, Yaya Detroit and Yaya Detroit and Tasha was nearby, and basically, they basically, they came up with this idea to mess with, to mess, you know, to gather energy from the kids and whatnot, so basically, they got, they got a, they got a baseball glove, and, tur- and, and taught to use her powers, and turn that baseball glove into a monster, and the monster, she just, you know, just, you know, hit the kids with a beam that, that forced them to quit baseball, you know, get up their dreams of playing baseball, and therefore, because, and therefore, that's when the monster started to drain their hockey energy. So basically, the only way to drain is to get hockey energy from humans is to even to even that you have to be sad, angry, or, or, or that to be in a sad state or an angry state or whatnot. So basically, the kids were in a sad state. So basically, the monster started to drain their gasoline energy. The Rangers showed up and basically, you know, it seemed like you know they were about to fight the fight the monster and. and and, and, and you know, and and Detroit and others, and that's when the opposite Joe said, "Wait, we're gonna wait. I get I got a better idea. So basically, we're gonna play a game of baseball, and basically, and basically, and we're gonna set this in, in the game of baseball. So basically, you know, uh, so the so the any so the hot so basically the hockey aliens accept the set the opposite Joe challenge, and the Rangers went along. So basically, you know, they got Boom Violet and Diesel." And they had to get uh, that, and also had Agent Saba as well to pop his hit in this game against the Hockey Aliens. Now, now turns out the thing turns out this is not a normal b- game of baseball. So basically, you know, Cannibal shows up, and he said, like, you know, I'm not gonna play the game, but I'm I'm going to be the coach uh, for the Hockey Alien team. So basically, like, you know, uh, basically he told. Hmm, he told he told he told Detroit the others if you guys lose I will modify you. So anyway, so basically if you guys lose this game, you know he told he told Tasha he told Tasha Detroit and Yaya and the and the foot soldiers you guys will all be I will modify I will re modify you guys. So basically you know and so basically. Detroit artist was afraid of being modified by a cannibal. After all, he used to he used the hockey alien captain of modifications, uh, uh, modification upgrades. Uh, for uh, after all, so anyway, you know, Officer Joe and the Rangers figured this is going to be an average game of baseball, but you know, the hockey, but it did not turn out this way. So basically, you know, you know, the you know the monster and the uh, the monster, the foot dogs and the hockey alien used their abilities to uh, to score mad hole ones and whatnot. And basically Joe said, Hey, this is not how this is not uh, this is not the way to play baseball. But Kenneth said that oh well hold on for a minute. You, you, we agreed to play we agree we agreed to play baseball but you didn't you did not stipulate it that we had to play regular baseball. So basically this is how the hockey aliens play baseball where we come from. So basically, you know, the Hashi Alien basically was creaming the crap out of the out of the out of the Rangers. So basically, you know, the when 
when when it was the uh, when it was the pick one of the monsters up up to, turn up to bat you know uh, officer joe with the picture and basically hit a pitch at the monster but the monster hit hit that hit the baseball so hard it slapped and it hit joe in the face and knocked him unconscious for for like eight innings so basically when officer joe came through he, he it was the it was the final inning and basically the hockey alien had 118 points and the and the blue angels had zero points on on the scoreboard so basically like you know like you know damn but officer joe said damn i was out for eight innings and basically you know the way the other way just playing that the hockey aliens you know were still playing that way baseball and whatnot we can't beat them so basically like you know you know like you know officer joe said well uh, so so basically if they want to put uh, if they want to play their base uh, if they're going to play their baseball if they want to play their baseball let's uh, let's just uh, let's uh, let's, uh, let's, uh, let's, uh, let's play our baseball so basically like you know so basically Oh, so basically the Rangers decided to morph up and basically and basically you know to stoop to the hockey aiding level and basically they morphed up and basically they gained the lead and whatnot and basically you know using their ranger powers and whatnot and finally uh, and they used their ranger powers to to tie the score up and basically it was up to Boom Red to hit a home run. It, 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 it was up to Boom Red to hit a home run and Boom Red transformed into his into his record form and basically, you know, I managed to I managed to get a home run and whatnot. And basically and the baseball it get ended with the with the boom with the boom boomers running the baseball game. So basically the so basically the the the, the, the baseball mid monster was not happy about this and he started to attack the Rangers but Boom Red used his, his zoom zoom blaster to destroy the baseball monster. So basically so basically Yaya used used his his grow bean to make the baseball monster grow and basically the the baseball monster started to burn down the stadium where where they were playing baseball at. So basically you know so basically Boom Boom transformed into his trader for and and, and and Leo showed up. So basically, you know, oh. so basically Boom Boom transformed into his mega sword form and basically Joe was piling Boom Boom and and, and Tyre was part was in was in the Fire Leo Zord. So basically, you know, and that's when Boom Boom that's when Boom Boom and uh, boom boom did uh, boom boom told tired that you know it's time to uh, it's time to form a new god tie so basically that's when so basically the fire leaders are can it can combine with boom boom and they form the fight they form the uh, they form the they form the the boom boom 911 negazord and basically took down took down the boom, took down the baseball mitt monster and and say and say the stadium from from being burned down so anyway just so after the monster was destroyed the kids wore all back to normal and whatnot and basically you know tire Tyre had donated some baseball equipment to 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 Joe's baseball to to Joe's to Joe's kids baseball team and whatnot. And basically, you know, everybody in there. So basically, like you know, anybody did have despite despite the shenanigans with the Haji Indians, they did not have a good time playing baseball. And basically, this is how the episode ended on this note with the with the with the what all the Rangers did. Just happy that you know that that the kids are playing baseball again, and basically, and basically, and saying that baseball is a good game to play, and basically, this is how the episode ended on this note. So anyway, you know, so anyway, this was a good episode. Once again, this is this is the, the third time we see. Um, this is the now this is like the fourth baseball episode we seen in Sentai. You know, so basically, you know. Q, Q, Q Ranger did it, you know, you know, Diving to did a baseball with me episode, I think, what's the name, I got the name that Sentai, it was old Sentai that did the first baseball game episode, but, you know, this was the fourth, this was the, this was the fourth greatest baseball game episode in Sentai history, so anyway, what do you guys think about this episode, good, bad, or just okay, please let me know in the comments below this podcast, anyway, signing off from Squeeze Reviews, run.